Hey everybody, it's Professor Williams and we're going to look at saving for retirement. In other words, how much will you need to put away every month so that when you get to retirement age, you can draw out a fixed monthly payment for a given number of years. So Ross has decided that he wants to build enough retirement wealth that if he invests his money at 6% per year, it's going to give him $3,700 in monthly income for 25 years of retirement. Problem is, to date, he has saved nothing. Good news is, he still has 15 years until he retires. So what we need to do is figure out how much money does he need to contribute per month for the next 15 years in order to have monthly income of $3,700 for 25 years. So let's figure out how much money he's going to need the end of this 15 years. So he wants to draw out 25 years worth of payments and those are going to be monthly payments. So he wants to be able to get 300 payments. He's going to be able to invest his money at 6% a year, but we have to convert that, remember, to a monthly interest rate of 0.50. Um, he wants his monthly retirement payments to be 3700 And remember, he's going to draw this out, so that's a negative. Um, and he's going to spend all of his retirement money. So we need to find out how much will he need today right, in order to get these 300 payments of $3,700 each. So let's calculate this present value. So cleared my time value money keys. So he wants 300 payments, that's our N. His interest rate per month is one half of a percent. Right? We're going to compute present value. We know that he wants his payments to be $3,700 and those are going to be payments that he draws out of this fund, so that's a negative. Right? And we know that he's going to live the 25 years and draw that out to zero, so that becomes a zero future value. And now we're going to compute his present value. So in order for him to be able to draw these 300 monthly payments of $3,700 each, he's going to need to have 574200 $65.40 in his retirement account. Now, remember he saved nothing. So the question becomes, how much does he need to put away every month for the next 15 years in order to have that $574,000 in the bank? All right, so he's got 15 years until retirement and he's gonna put away month money every month. So that means that he's going to be making payments for 180 months. We knew that he was going to invest this money at 6%. We converted that to a monthly interest rate of 0 0.50. And he's already told us he hasn't saved anything yet. So his present value is 0. But we knew from our previous step that in the future, he needs to have $574,265.40. So the question becomes, how much do these 180 payments need to be at 6% interest in order to have that amount in the future? So let's see what we've got. Um, 180 payments is our N. His monthly interest rate, remember, was 0 0.50. Um, poor Ross has saved nothing, so present value is nothing. But we do know what that future value needs to be, and it needs to be the $574,265.40 needs to be his future value. And now let's compute the payment that's necessary in order to have that amount. And we come up with $1,974.65. So in order to have 25 years worth of monthly income, he's going to need to put away this $1,974 every month for the next 15 years until 
he retires. As always, I hope that you found this useful and thank you for watching.